welcome back to an episode of we are again confronted with busy servers and in this case we're going to enter this one look at that it's 8500 and whatnot that can take a very long time until all of those are down to position one and you're actually in the game sometimes you can't even get in here into the server selection so you are actually greeted by a nice message that tells you the servers are overloaded and you can't do anything you can't even change the regions let's say and if i for example want to change my region from central europe to east america in this case i click on that this would be okay i just click on the tick mark here and then the next time around the game starts in the different region but what if your servers are overloaded and you can't even get into the selection this is the thing if you need to change the selection you actually need to do something very specific you have to open this document over here that's a very special one because that has a very specific line down at the bottom with region ids specified absolutely important and um, in this case ce stands for central europe there's also wa for west america there's ea for east america and there's sa for south america so depending on what location is closest to you and if you have over loaded servers let's say choose another region that is in a different time zone so that you playing the game goes into an off period of another region and you can still select everything that's the main reason behind that where is this document to begin with in order to find that you have to open the document folder of course it's in uh, this specific folder right there we have um, in this case whatever hard drive this is the directory to the steam folder followed by steam apps common lost arc of course then this folder right here ef game and then you go into the config subfolder and then you are greeted with this one here user options if that one does not open itself you simply have to right click the thing and click on open with and then you can select the editor and once you do that of course you can open it with the editor let's keep that open so that you know where everything is get into the folder open up the user options and then scroll all the way to the bottom or search for region id as i said it's this one down here and then you are just changing this one right here the ce if you are somewhere in america you change wa or ea to ce or something like that because once we go to bed, then uh, the servers are ready for more load and uh, you can basically play the game. Sometimes just choosing a different uh, area works flawlessly. Anyway, the game is also available in Russia and Korea, of course, but under a different version. In this case, they are more advanced, let's say. <laughs> they have more classes and everything. Um, so they are not available. At least not if you uh, don't want to use a VPN or something. Anyway, let's change this the ce to in this case ea because this is closest to my location the ping to be handled in here is uh, actually very interesting the ping itself is somewhere in the 30s and maximum 50 let's say in your current region but if you go a little bit further away it basically quadruples so you end up with instead of 50 milliseconds maximum with 200 milliseconds maximum in this case for me it's between 30 and 150 so ea is 150 milliseconds just keep that in mind so it's not getting absolutely better you're just getting some service with less load so um let's keep that as ea and save that thing of course and then what we are going to do is we're going to deactivate the game and we are going to open it a second time right you can't see that right now because it's not hooked yet. Uh, but in a minute, there we go. This is a smagger thing and whatnot. And the tripod studio sign. And uh, but of course, a warning for epilepsy and so on. There's also a photosensitive mode in here that reduces the flashes in game. Anyway, let's see how we are greeted. And we are greeted immediately with the East North America thing. And because now is actually the time where all of the servers are changing because most of Europe goes to bed and the rest <laughs> in Eastern uh, or North America and starts playing now. That means the servers are now starting to get busy. Sometimes you need to go even a little bit further west. To, as I said, keep in mind that working the way you want it to. So let's just click on, sometimes you can even select busy servers, like this one right here. You are not greeted with a timer or anything or a queue. It just says it's busy, that's it. 
if it's good, then of course it's much better. But now we can just uh, change the classes. And I actually started to make a gunner class before. And I had a very, very decent idea to save my customization. So if you want to transition a character, or in this case it's not really transitioning, if you want to transition a look, you just, um, well, you have to save it beforehand, of course. But in this case, we can also load a lock. And there we go. What a beauty, isn't that? Now, uh, we can just apply changes and whatnot, get into the game, and then everything will be fine. As I said, just keep in mind that the uh, latency may not be on par with your current location. But at least you can play, and you don't have to stand in line for three or five hours in a row. I think I want to see this character actually being made in here, so let's just uh, do that real quick. There we go. Bam. You can... Uh, as I said, get into the server, everything is fine. There's also, in the settings, something very, 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 very convenient. It's not in here, you can only select this in-game. It's in the gameplay thingy. And then you can activate the, uh, the latency display and see how the latency has actually changed from your character to now. Let's keep that short and you can enjoy the game at a later point in time. So, get the folder structure correct and of course, change the region ID to whatever you want. It's one of the four, at least for the Western regions in general. So CA, Central Europe, WA, West America, EA, East America, SA, South America. All right, now, happy playing and uh, don't get too annoyed by the latency. <laughs> Ta-ta.